person that says goof in the cut. Hey, who are you? Get out of my house! Is your recording device working? Yes. Are you sure? Yeah. I'm here to tell you about an occurrence that's been happening all around the globe. My colleagues and I have come to refer to it as the formulation of rectangles. You must listen to my words. Seriously. You must listen to what I have to say. Please, I implore you, take this tape and pass it along. The world is in danger of collapsing in on itself if we do not remedy this problem. Now, you may not understand these words as I say them, but make sure you look at the world around you. Make sure you pay attention to every small meaning, because every little step may be greater than you think. In order for the formulation of rectangles to break existence, one thing must happen. There is one thing we must destroy. And now I will tell you what the formulation of rectangles is. It's as simple as this. Hi, I'm James Dean, pretty much the caretaker for this town, making sure people going where they're supposed to, making sure people doing what they're supposed to be doing. I give advice, I say hello, wave my hand, give smiles. I love this fucking town.
seen a lot of strange things happening lately. Things I had never read before in textbooks. Sometimes I think the whole universe is gonna collapse on itself. Other times I think everything's gonna be just fine. It's all gonna be okay. People are just trying to have fun. Anything strange going on lately? No, nothing. You didn't notice anything out of the ordinary? Anything weird? No. Nope. I'm going go inside and see what's up. Nothing, I'm just hanging out, man. Seriously, you all right? You've been acting weird lately, man. Nothing, I'm fine. Just leave me alone, I'm just hanging out. Your boyfriend just disappeared. What? Listen, your boyfriend just vanished into thin air. Gone. Don't think about it. Listen. It's gonna be all right. I'm gonna take care of it. You have to stay here. Don't talk to strangers. Don't talk to anyone. You have to stay here, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna go, and you can come. You can go to the countryside. I don't know what's gonna happen. I don't know if we're all gonna die. If the universe is gonna collapse on itself. Why are you yelling at me? I don't have all the answers. I don't know what's gonna happen. I'm gonna fix it though. It's gonna be all right. We're gonna be fine. I'm gonna meet you. I'm gonna meet you in a beautiful, a beautiful place up high in the hills. We can raise our children there. We can we can let them grow up and have swimming pools, and and they, and they can go in the fields and pick, pick dandelions and, and put them up to their chins and make it gold on the bottom of their chin. We can grow a garden, and we can plant seeds and have a family. Listen, meet me in the countryside. disappeared in front of my eyes. Gone! Completely vanished! He's gone. He's... He's totally gone. He... He vanished. Yeah! Gone. Completely gone. vanished. He's out of the picture! Gone. 
He's gone. He's gone. He totally gone. disappeared gone. without a trace. I didn't he, know where the hell oh, he went. He couldn't have gone out the gone. window. He couldn't he's have gone, gone this way. He's he didn't gone. go up. He didn't go down. It was. He was he's, gone. He's not here. Com gone. Completely gone. 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 He was there. Out now there. he's not. He Beyond. Was... I don't know where. Like he was. Like he was there. What the fuck? <sighs> Fucking shit, man. I mean, come on. I am the one that will show you the way. I can give you a choice, a choice to choose. And in that choice, you will have a chance to transcend from this life to the next. Though I am not so sure it will be as bright as one might expect. Alright, alright fine. I can dance for you. Huh? Huh? You can dance for me. Continue. I am the being that will bring all other beings back into existence. My existence. Dude, where are we? I think we're in hell, dude. I, I, don't, I don't feel any different. No, I feel all right. Yeah, continue this story. So the judge walks out, right, and he's wiping the vomit off of his face, <laughs> and his wife just shoves him in the van. The judge? Do you understand what I'm talking about? Mm -hmm. Burt Lancaster right. and Yul Brenner disappeared in front of my eyes. Right in front of your eyes. Right in front. I came over here because Sal Menu vanished before me. Uh -huh. Gone. In, in, into nowhere. Do you, you, you do realize that, uh, this isn't even your house? Yeah! Okay. Just saying. I'm telling you, the, the person that lives here is gone. Did you see him? Right there. He was right, to, he was standing there. The guy that made me dance. The guy that made me jive, the guy that Jimmy. made me do the jig. Jimmy. I was dancing, I was Jimmy. feeling it. Jimmy. I was happy with it. Jimmy, I think you might be freaking out a little bit. I mean, there's no one there. Jimmy, you know what I think? I think you need a nice girl to take home, you know, make her dinner, unbutton her pants a little bit. Zip them down. There will not be many more times when I can look at you from afar and allow you to explain my story. But this will be the only time that I let you live. You know, make her feel good downtown. Ginger! What? You're not listening to me! Ugh. Are you serious? I'm listening to you. No, 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 I'm serious. People I'm serious. are disappearing. Life Jimmy. is destructing in front of us. It's it's gonna it's gonna flip out. It's gonna it's gonna go Jimmy, backwards. Out. I'm not I'm not kidding here. Ginger, listen to what I'm trying to say I'm for once you in your life. I'm Try to hear the words that I'm saying when I uh, listen to this. Stop listen to me. me. Stop yelling. <laughs> Oh! Ah! Damn it. Jesus! Fucking shit. Linsky, he couldn't even get into the boys' bathroom, so he went right to the girls' bathroom and just threw up everywhere. All of it. I had to clean it up. It was disgusting, right? I got free beers for this, and I thought... Uh... <laughs> Like I made you dance. You can make me dance like I made you dance. You can make me.
and dance like I make you dance. You can make me dance like I make you dance. You can make me dance like I make you dance. You can make me dance like I make you dance. You can make me dance like I make you dance. You can make me, you can make me, make me dance. very important to tell you. It's something me and my colleagues refer to as the formulation of rectangles. Tell your friends, please. Because love is the only thing that will save us. There is a man who appears to be wise. Do not give him your knowledge because he will take it and use it as his own. And then you will vanish from existence forever. Never to be used. All right. I can give you a choice. A choice to choose. What kind of choice would that be? I can give you a choice, a choice to choose. given a choice. A choice to choose. Okay. What does that mean? I was given a choice. A choice to choose. Okay. So how so? He's gone. What do you mean? He just disappeared. I don't understand. I don't either. Can I get a small? I don't understand. Does a man leave his woman? All the time. I'm sorry. But I was given a choice. A choice to choose. I don't understand. So this man showed up on my couch and he gave me a choice to choose and I chose the choice and I don't know what's going to happen now. I don't get it. I don't understand. You will. You have to choose. It's a full moon outside. It's beautiful. I get crazy when it's a full moon. I can't sleep. I never can sleep.
Madeline, did you ever wonder what it would be like if we got together? You're not my type, Bing. But I still love you. There's a guy standing over there. Yeah, he's the guy. He gave me a choice. A choice to choose. Do you think he'll give me a choice? A choice to choose? Why don't you go ask him? Okay. I was told you'd give me a choice choice to choose. What you were told was correct. So what do I do now? Well, what would you like? What ails you, friend? It's a full moon outside. I get crazy when it's a full moon. I never sleep. I can't ever sleep. I just want to sleep. Are you ready to choose? I've been ready my whole life. There's only one thing that you have to do. Just tell me what I have to do. I'll do anything. I just want to sleep. <laughs> Howl at the moon. I haven't slept like that in 13 years. I feel great. I feel like a superhuman. I got energy again. I just want to be clean. I want to feel alive. I want to feel new. It's the best fucking water I had in 13 years. I feel alive, I feel clean. The way it went down my throat into my guts, it felt so good. I feel fantastic. I feel great. I feel like I could do anything. I feel so strong. Ah. Gregory Peck's here. He comes around all the time. Every day, all he wants to do is drive around. I'm past those days. I 
feel like a new man. I'm alive. I just want to do my own thing now. Hey man, you want to go for a ride? I should kill this guy. I know I can. I don't know why I've been wasting 13 years hanging around with this douche. What's going on here? What is this whole uh, He-Man charade you're putting on? What's the deal? Times have changed. I've changed. I've become a new man. Last night I slept for the first time in 13 years. I met someone. He was tall, dark, slender, had these big eyes, this wild ass smile. He was the devil. I sold my soul to him for sleep and now I got everything back. I'm sick and tired of hanging out with you in your scum ass van and the women you bring around here. I'm done with those days. Okay, man, maybe my van's a little bit dirty, but that's beyond the point, man. I know the devil, and he does not look like anything you just described him as, man. He's short like me. He's like this high. You're full of shit, man. I saw the devil. He's got this bandana thing around his chest, and he walks on. He creeped out into my yard out of nowhere. I've seen the devil, man. I know the devil. Diablo is petite. You can put him in your pocket. You don't know a dick. Oh, yeah? Hey, I miss the old Bing Crosby. Come on, let's go. I just, I just oiled up the old baby. Let's go for a cruise around the town. I'm done with you. I'm above you. You don't even understand what I've become. Man, you changed. Leave me alone. Go home. Hey man, one day, one day you're gonna realize what life really is about. I know what life is. I found it. I found the meaning of it. Yeah, well, I'm going. Good. Get the fuck out of here. Take your fucking van right. and leave. Well, um, if you wanna, um, hang, yeah, you know, make love to some I loose chicks, you know, you know who to call. All right. Been there, done that. All right. Loose chicks. Loose chicks, you get them. You go. I don't know what's got into him. He used to be a rocker. Now I don't even know what the heck he is. Wake up, wake up, come on, wake up, come outside, it's nice outside, it's really nice, come on, why won't you come outside, come on. I keep hearing these voices inside my head. Come outside. They're telling me to go outside. Come talk to me. They're calling me. Come on. I have to go. Come outside and I have talk to go to outside. Me. There's a fat man sitting in the field eating Chinese food. You can hear my thoughts? Yes, I can. Who are you? You can call me Vincent Price. So, you're the devil? Yes, I am. Then who did I talk to last night? Oh, him. He is the formulation of rectangles. 
Would you like to join me? There's something I'd like to show you. Now that you know about the formulation of rectangles, I think you should choose happiness. Go get a stromboli. They're filled with meat and cheese. They're great. It might be your last chance to get one. You never know when you'll get another stromboli because the formulation of rectangles might whisk you away out of existence. Biggity boo. <laughs> but seriously. You need to stand up for yourself, for everyone around you, and say, you can't control me. I'm in control of my own self, and you can't take that away from me. You have to make a choice, or you'll live constantly looking around your shoulder. not afraid of the formulation of rectangles. I had the worst day at work. So sick of being a dental assistant. I don't want to sort papers anymore. I want to feel like I'm doing something with my life. Didn't anything good happen today? No, nothing good happened. And that's why I just want to sit down with my girlfriend, kiss you on the neck, on the lips, on the cheeks. And I just want to be with you and love you tonight like we used to. You know, it's been so long. I, this job's really killing me. What is that in your hand? Oh, this, it's a sword. <laughs> there was one good thing that happened today. I, I found this sword. I, I was walking home from work. I saw some kids playing, you know, the normal thing. And that I found this. It's, it, it's pretty cool. Look. <sighs> What the hell just happened? Did you see that? Did you see that? Listen, hon, you're stressed out. Come to bed. You'll feel better. All right, if you say so. Hey. So, you remember when we used to, like, I don't know, Play around a little bit more. Remember this one? Remember this one? <laughs> Steamroller! Ah, Steamroller! Steamroller. Oh, Steamroller. it's squishy! Oh, it's so squishy! Steamroller. You're steering me, squishy! I'm so squishy! And you're just walking around being squished. Like a sex machine. Oh, God, get on up. Listen to me. I have to tell you about the... I have to tell you about the formulation of. What do you think? Well, listen, formulation of what? Formulation of what? No. Formulation of what? No. Listen, you're just stressed out about Dr. Klein and all the paperwork. No, 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 no,
Hey, babe. Thanks for the tea. Oh, I know you feel better after tea. Hey, you're wearing a bathing suit. Yeah, you always love it when I wear a bathing suit. Did you wear it for me? I wore it for you. Really? Yeah. I know that you like to hump my boobs. <laughs> yeah, well, actually today I was thinking about humping your butt, but it's really nice. All this. Thanks. Want to go to the bedroom? Yeah. Okay. She's gone. I think it's over. I think she's gone. I, uh, I, I didn't pay the electric bill last month. Oh, no. What do you think it means? I don't know. Sometimes the companies, they, they freak out. They send these ghosts, you know, like these ghost-like things to scare you. But you be so irresponsible, Marlon. It's not the point, Ingrid. I can't live like this. What do you want from us? citizens are we really living in a world where a man can't try to raise a family without some devil temptress stealing his children is this 
some kind of planet where everything has to go awry? This is my home. And you have imposed yourself upon me and my girlfriend. So I beg you, leave. And if you do not leave, I will force you to leave. Or my name is not Marlon Brando. I'm terribly sorry, but the formulation of rectangles is real, and I have been taken by it. Hey. Hey. What have you been doing? I sold my soul to the devil. Then I found out it wasn't the real thing. Then I met the real devil. And he told me I really didn't sell my soul. You mind if I use the gym for a little while? Well, if it isn't my old friend, John Wayne. Hey, what's up, man? I've been meaning to call you. That's fucking bullshit, man. You've been dodging me left and right. You owe me five fucking grand. I'm gonna bust your ass right now if you don't pay me. I don't know what you're talking about. You know what I'm talking about, motherfucker? That was a long time ago. Leave it in the past. Leave it in the past, huh? Leave it in the past? Yeah. Leave it in the past. How about I leave you in the past? <coughs> what the fuck? What the fuck?
saw this coming, motherfucker. Hey Orson, did you get mad if I told you I killed John Wayne upstairs in the gym? Yeah, I get fucking mad. That means I gotta clean him up. Yeah, man. Well, I killed him. What? You killed John Wayne up in my gym. He's no more, man. The fuck? John Wayne is no more. Whatever, man. Whatever. It's raining pretty hard. Yup. It's raining. Pretty hard. It's fucking beautiful, man. I love it when it rains. It's some pretty hard rain. That's what they said. You killed John Wayne in my gym. Killed him in the rain. Everybody dies in the rain. I'm pissed at you. Because you killed John Wayne in my gym. But I'll still be your friend. Fair enough. Hi, I'm Orson Welles. I was named after one of the greatest filmmakers of the 20th century. The guy made Citizen Kane, did the War of the Worlds broadcast. I was named after him mostly because of my charisma, my style, my broad chin. Yeah, it's pretty cool being named Orson Welles, you know? A lot of recognition. People are like, hey, Orson Welles, what are you doing? I'm like, uh, I don't know, not making Citizen Kane, but you know, trying to live up to the name as much as I can. I got my chin, I got my style, I got my charisma. My name is Orson Welles. Now, you may be thinking, because hold my it, name hold is... Hold it, hold it, hold it. Odie, cut. Cut the tape. What? What's the problem? Odie, Odie, this thing sucks. People what? don't want it. I don't want a horror story. What Steve, are you Steve McQueen didn't give you a half a million dollars. Steve McQueen doesn't want you building... You gave me half a million dollars so I could make a good film. You don't film. understand. It's a horror movie. We don't want a horror movie. People what's, don't want a horror movie. What's the problem movies. with the horror movie? I want a love story. I don't love want story. this guy in the movie. He's horrible. What's wrong with I him? Want, I want you to star in the movie. I want you to be Cary Grant. I'm not Grant. an actor. But you could be an actor. Work at it. Try. I want you to be Cary Grant. Think. Cary Grant. Steve McQueen tells you what he wants. That's fine, what I want. Fine, this fine. guy is horrible. Right, okay. I want this hunter guy right, out of here. Fine. Now, okay? Okay. Great. Fabulous. <sighs> sorry, dude. Um, I got no control over this. You're, you're fired. What, well, what do you mean? I mean, I'm I've sorry. Been... You, you saw but what I happened. You gotta get that... out of here. I gotta leave. There's no I'm discussion. Sorry. No discussion. Odie, you don't have to be the nice guy. It's my money. I want him out of here. Right, well, fine. Hunter, you're right. not the guy. Then I want this. my check. I want fine. No problem. I'll give you whatever your labor union calls for. I've been for. working for six but hours. No then. problem. Six dollars. My money. You're gone. I call the shots. Fine. And that's whatever. It. You guys are crazy. I'm out of here. Come on, Odie. Think positive and get it done. Come on. This will be good. Good love story.
So, what are we doing? I don't know. You don't know? I don't know what I'm going to do. This guy shoot half the movie, uh -huh. shoot an hour of the movie, and this guy wants me to change the entire thing. I have a horror film, and he wants me to make a love story. And I use all my actors. I spent, uh, spent four hundred thousand dollars already. I have, so I have a hundred thousand left. That's it. And I have to make a, I have to remake a movie. No, you don't have to remake a movie. You make it a love story. Phase into the love story. It's a horror. I don't want to hear this. You're a professional. I'm a professional. This is how we work. Like that, on the fly. You make it a love story. I'm a good looking guy, I'll do the part. He wants me to act in it. Whoa, whoa. I don't want to act in it. Whoa. Anthony Quinn is here. <laughs> Anthony Quinn works for one man. Anthony Quinn. What Anthony Quinn says goes, I know women. I work at a bar. You shoot a script, I'll get your women. He wants Cary Grant. Don't, don't tell me about Cary Grant. Cary Grant's a has-been. And possibly dead. Fine, so you'll you'll act in it, right? Yeah. I, I'm a good looking guy, right? Yeah. I, sure. I, I could do this part, right? I got romance coming out of my balls. Alright, man. Alright, man. Alright. Well. Make it happen. OD. Anthony Quinn's a busy man. <laughs> I need you, Catherine Hepburn. I need you. You look, we have bad times. Of course we have bad times. We have good times too, don't we? And 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 this we can get through this. I I've been a jerk. I've been wrong. I've been wrong. I've been unappreciative of you. And I know that you your your only care was for me, Catherine Hepburn. But now I, Anthony Quinn, want to care for you. How can you say that? You're so distant. Distant? I'm right here. I've always been right here for you. You you act like you don't care. I, it's just, it's hard. I know how hard it is. It's a relationship. If it was easy, it would be marriage. But this is a relationship. Look, Catherine Hepburn. I've been a jerk. I know this, but I'm ready to make this more about you and less about me. Look, do, do you do you want the moon? Look, I'll give you the moon. I'll throw a lasso around and I'll give you the moon. You want the stars? I'll give you the stars. Whatever you want. It's about you now. It's about us. Do you really mean it? Because I, <laughs> I want a family. I want to get married. I, I want it all. I want you and... I want kids, and I just want you to be good to me. Of course, I love you. Do you really mean it? Of course, I love you. Oh, I love you. Did you hear that? Yeah, I heard that. Why does this keep happening? I'm so scared. Don't, Hold me. Don't Hold worry, me, Catherine Anthony. Hepburn. I got you. Anthony <laughs> Quinn is here. He'll protect you. I'll protect you. Snash the hold. Whoa. What are you doing here? Why don't you just leave us alone?
found myself alone, searching for the formation of rectangles. Marilyn was nowhere to be found. I wonder if she had been taken as well. I would make things right. I'd be the one to undo the evil deeds. No one could stop me. Not the devil. Not the formulation of rectangles. No one. I began to realize that this being, this thing, was brought into existence because of the human race's collective thought. We are all filled with such negative emotion that subconsciously we realize how unnecessary we are. We realize that we are a plague on this earth and we wish to find a solution. Our solution to that problem is to vanish from the world. But I don't have that problem. I'm not of a weak mind. I'm not of a weak soul. I want to live, not for me, for Marilyn. There is an answer out there and I'm gonna find it. I'm tired of these games. Let's finish this. You may think you know me. You may think you know the answer. But you are mistaken. You're just a figment of everyone's imagination. Oh really? Then how can I do this? Those are just cheap parlor tricks, old boy. Eat this. You pack quite a wall, my friend. But what about this? Cheese doodles. <laughs> All right. I could play this game. How about this? How about this? Applesauce. <laughs> oh yeah? How about this? Juice. I uh, quit the movie. Wait, what? <laughs> I quit. I thought, I thought it was going good. Yeah, I thought I you were going to do a nah. love story. I tried doing a love story. People started disappearing. What do you mean? I just disappeared. I don't want to talk about it. Wait, this. like they, like you couldn't find them, or like they just disappeared. Really? Mm -hmm. Well, sounds crazy, man. Yeah. So. Uh, it's a bummer. Are, so you're not doing the movie anymore? No, I'm done. I'm, I can hang out. So you do anything right now? No, I'm just sitting here. All right. Then I guess the only place to go is Lawrence. Let's go. Yeah. Yes. All right, man. Masterpiece, this is it. Come on, let's go. We're going to learn. How do I melt the cheese? Get it out. Come on, say it. Okay, hey, you guys go to Loggers. I'm doing the movie by myself, man. Huh? This is my my film. Mine. This is mine. How about ice cream? I'm gonna fucking melted cheese. Come on. How about pudding? How about potato chips? How about cinnamon raisins? After I threw the juice in his face, I knew it was over. His reign on this earth had come to an end, so now I would walk alone. I would be known as the man who defeated the formulation of rectangles until another evil came into this world and I would be ready, ready and waiting, because that's what I do. But it was not over yet. There was one thing I still had to do, to right all the wrongs. One thing to save all the souls that were taken from this world.
Apple. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. 